Hey guys, what is up? Out back again for another video. So I recently just did an Instagram poll to see what supplement review you guys would like to see first. So I had two of them. I had Steel Supplements and I had Psychopharma. Sure enough, Psychopharma won because I don't know if it's as known as Steel Supplements. I'm not sure. I've recently been seeing uh, Psychopharma on my social media. Been recently seeing it. Um, it was on my Facebook and on my Instagram, my YouTube. It's like, you know what? I'll just check it out. See what it's all about. What the hype is about with this. So you might have been seeing, you know, these videos popping up on your screen. It puts a smile on my face because this ain't your stupid freaking corporate America horse crap product. This is strong. This is the new wave of supplementation, of pre-workout explosiveness, laser freaking focus, intensity, goosebumps, stuff that makes me want to grip the weights and rip them in half. Anyway, so today we're going to be doing um, an unboxing of the samples I just got from them. Um, free shipping, of course. It's great. You should get them. They're like nine bucks for the samples. Free shipping. And uh, yeah, links down below if you guys want to get these. I'm going to be doing these supplements for a week and testing them for a week and letting you guys know exactly how I feel at the end of this week in regards to these supplements. And I'm going to give you guys a rating, my own personal rating. And let's go ahead and get started. Let's get open this and see what's inside. I'm not. I'm actually not even sure what's in here, to be honest with you. All I knew was just pre-workout. That's all I knew was in here. So I'm excited to see what's in here. All right, we're going to go ahead and open this here. That was a pain in the ass to open, but other than that, not a big deal. So, yep, here's my order. Hey, I didn't know that. They gave me a shaker cup. So, you know what? Skip this shit. We don't need any of that. We'll use this. There's a lot more than I was expecting there to be in here. So, what's this? 10% off of my next store purchase. And this is basically just, you know, info about the supplements. And we have a shit load. I was not expecting this. Oh my god. Just loads of these things. Okay. So, we have BCAAs. So, we'll be using these throughout the week. So, I have three of them from what it looks like so far. Um... We have blue lemonade pre-workout, 10 grams. We have another one, 10 grams. And we have this thing called Canna Rush, uh, anti-stress and anxiety, rest, relax, recover. So this is a recovery supplement. Um, we have another one, another one of these. We have three of those. Okay, what else do we have in here? There's a lot more than I was expecting in here. We have a Serenity NRG Kush Rush. Uh, stimulate Euphoria, Focus Energy, Feel Good, Fat Burner. So there's a Kush Rush blend. I don't know what that is. Um, we have Infinite Brain. Uh... Not really sure. It says improves your attention span as your seat focus, cognitive enhancement. So, this one's actually not, has, doesn't have as much caffeine in it. So, that's okay. So, we have more pre workout. We have uh, strawberry watermelon popsicle. That sounds pretty good. Uh, and we have another one of those. And we have another fat burner. And that looks like that's what's inside of the box. So,. Let's take the BCAAs and let's take the pre-workout and let's get onto my workout here. Yeah, the way this uh, BCAA and I'm sure the pre-workout's the same, just tastes like it's gonna kick my ass for sure. Like I can taste the chemicals. I'm really curious on how this is gonna affect me today and for the rest of my workouts this week. As you guys know, I work out three days a week, 
and I take Keno Octane. There's some days I take two scoops, which is 300 milligrams. But the thing about Keno Octane is it has L-theanine. It works synergistically with caffeine. So you don't have the jitters. There's no crash afterwards and you don't feel itchy. You don't feel like shit. So I've never really left that pre-workout at all. Like that's my favorite pre-workout of all time. Um, but I've recently began to like go back and just explore these, especially with you guys, just review them, see how they work with my body. So onto the pre-workout. I said to start out with a half a scoop acid bucket. I put most of it in there. There's a little bit left inside the packet, but I wanted to, I wanted the pump that they've been talking about. So I'm gonna take the pre-workout here. This is actually not that bad. And we're gonna have a good ass workout. Before I dive into the workout actually, I'm gonna explain how I'm feeling, okay? So I'm shaking. <laughs> Second, I'm itchy which is a normal, you know, symptom and also jitters is pretty common when it comes to pre-workouts. I feel good though, for some reason. Like I feel like this nice euphoria. I was reading the label and I was actually even watching their advertisements, like what's inside of this stuff. So there's, just, I, f I forget what it's called, but it's like you're very euphoric, gives you a euphoric feeling, you feel happy. I feel really good. Like, I feel like I can beat the shit out of somebody. So, let's get started on this workout, yeah? So, uh, let's uh, exclude everything I just said earlier. When they come, and they will, they'll come for you. I have an army. We have a Hulk. Oh, I thought the beast had won the Hulk. You're missing the point. There's no throne. There is no version of this where you come out on top. Let me infiltrate the beat. Concentrate the heat. If you ain't on my level. Can't let me be, I'll be going till it's all in motion Talking killing rappers, then I hit my quota And my train of thought is more a locomotive Talking reason for it, I got locomotive Used to be on a revenge tip On a stun on my ex and a friend's tip I was Spider-Man whipping the black suit I was powerful but almost lost Luke Blurring the line between human and artist Try not to change but I swear it's the hardest I swear when you're up they turn you to a target Home was a trip, my life ain't what I'm talking So, what it take to be an icon? All in your desktop, so I just might already be one. My me with the label, it feels on the table. One sign, but I'm down for a free lunch. Just speaking my heat seeking missiles of hits, but other than me, I see no heat exists. Yo, gas up, I'm about to go green. Go green, go green. Damn it. Whoa! I feel like ripping these weights in half. I gripped the weights and ripped them in half! Life's about to be a cold war. I'm the hero that they asked for. Green, 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 green. I'm about to go, I'm about to go. Green, green, green. I'm about to go, I'm about to go green. I'm about to go, I'm about to go green. Get the fuck back, I'm about to go green. I might begin making a feature a rack. Cause when I hit your beat, I turn shit to Iraq. Dropping bombs like I'm cursing you out. This your house, then I'm kicking you out. Quiet as a mouse came in the. Hey guys, it's currently 10 o'clock. I am editing a video. It's the end of day one using Psycho Pharma products. I used the Edge of Insanity and the BCAAs, I forget what they're called. Um, I'm currently editing a video and uh, I'm about to make food, but I wanted to give you guys an update on my current situation. So today's workout was pretty good. Um, that was really, really like on edge. Like literally the title of that pre-workout is literally what you're gonna get side effect wise edge of insanity you're just on edge focused everything is blocked out and surprisingly i didn't get a caffeine crash today because typically pre-workouts do that so good on that and uh yeah we'll go on to day two um which will be wednesday and we'll continue this journey off Hey guys, so it is day two. Instead of, you know, just recording it on my workout days, since I have a lot of samples, I figured I would, you know, test some of them on my off days. So this one is Infinite Brain. Uh, it has 600 milligrams of alpha GPC. Um, improves your attention span, edge off your seat focus, cognitive enhancement. I'm actually right in the middle of a class lecture right now on a break. So I thought this would be a great idea to take and mix it up in here my intermittent fasting 
video just uploaded, so you're obviously going to see this after the upload. So, I'm going to take this, and I'll get to you guys after class and let you guys know how I feel. So, I kind of muted my lecture for just a second, just so I could do a taste test for you guys real quick. This is Lemonade Punch. It tastes good. I like that. Um, yeah, this is really good. I'll let you guys know how it affects me at the end of this lecture. So stay tuned for that. All right, so the results are in for this one, Infinite Brain. Um, it's acidic. I can, you know, feel that acidic feeling in my throat. Um, but other than that, I'm, like, very alert, very, you know, chilled out at the same time. And I feel like I can get a lot of work done. So I'm going to continue editing not only this video, but more videos to come because I feel very productive right now. So stay tuned for uh, tomorrow as I go through my other workout as, on the pre-workout in the BCAAs. See you then. Hey guys, what's up? Alec back. We're at day three. So last time I had the strawberry and watermelon popsicle um, pre-workout. This time I'm going to be using the blue lemonade pre-workout. We're going to see how this one tastes. And of course, we're taking the anytime, not anytime, Asylum Anytime BCAAs. This is apple watermelon. That's all they gave. And uh, I'll give you guys a taste test before we get into the workout. Give it a good shake. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Why not? Sizzling like a bitch in there. So, pop that sucker open. See how it tastes. Oh my god, I like that one a lot better than the other one. Ooh, I like that one a lot. Yeah, definitely the taste on this one, nine and a half, ten out of ten. This is really good. Okay, definitely feeling it in my hands and feet again. Whatever you do, disclaimer, do not take as much as I'm taking. It says to start out with a half of a serving, but I'm not. I'm doing full on servings because I'm usually used to 300 milligrams. This is 350. So... Today, we're actually going to be doing a one-arm push-up by itself without using parallettes. So, let's try it. Okay, so day three is done. So this, this is definitely a really, really strong workout, pre-workout. So if you have a caffeine sensitivity, start out very light on this if you ever decide to get it. Very, very strong. I was popping a bunch of blood vessels in my eye today because of uh, how strong it was. So I'm definitely probably gonna take, cut back the caffeine intake on it. Probably use a half scoop like you mentioned. Um, and yeah. Again, that was a great workout. I actually achieved a decline one-arm push-up. I've been practicing getting up to that point. That'll be for a different video though, but 
for sure that was probably not the best form because the opposite chest has to go down so just more practice right all right i'll see you guys on day four hey guys what is up so it is day for number four and we're trying canna rush i'm in the middle of a class lecture again so instead of a powder this is actually capsules so i'm interested to see how these work so i'm going to take these and at the end of this lecture i'll let you guys know how i'm feeling so i'm done with my lecture and i feel really 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 good like i'm relaxed chilled out but i'm very alert and i very much like this supplement canna rush so i like this one infinite brain and i like the bcaas and i actually somewhat like the pre-workout so there's only one more thing I haven't tried, and that's the fat burner. But that may be for a Saturday or a Friday video. I'm not sure. I might not do it, just to give you guys a glimpse of all the other ones. So we'll be going on to day five after today. So see you then. Hell yeah, my tricep's popping. It's a popping. Yeah. Oh, damn. You guys guessed it. it is the last day of using psychopharma products at the end of my workout today i'll be giving you guys my own personal rating on how i feel about these supplements and if i recommend it or not so stay tuned let's get through this workout one thing i forgot to mention about this pre-workout is it helps you breathe a lot better so like it helps out with my crack use a little bit making it a little bit easier I'm just kidding. I do not condone any drugs. I'm just waiting for this pre-workout to kick in, so I'm trying to get a little pumped. So, let's get to it. As you can see, I can obviously do more with weighted chin-ups or pull-ups, but I've burnt myself out and it's so hard to do anything with my back, vertically and horizontal pulling, burn out, my biceps are toasted, still got legs to do. This stuff is getting me through though. This stuff is getting me through. So I'm gonna rip out some pull-ups and uh, we'll call it a day on these.
I am so, so tired. All right, so it is the end of the video. And it's probably the thing that you guys have been waiting for the whole time is the rating. Drum roll, please. The rating. Eight out of ten. The uh, the supplements, like as a whole, definitely an eight out of ten. The reason why I'm ducking the points is because of the side effects that I got from the pre-workout. But it doesn't make it an overall bad pre-workout. It was a really good pre-workout. And I don't get, you know, caffeine crashes afterwards, like a lot of pre-workouts. So definitely recommend this pre-workout. But disclaimer, if you're not used to 350 milligrams of caffeine at a time, start out with a half scoop and then work your way up from there because you need to find your tolerance before you can even, you know, use this product. Because let me tell you, you will feel on edge. Great company with great supplements. I definitely loved the Infinite Brain, and I definitely loved Canna Rush. Those were my two favorite. Oh yeah, and BCAAs. And I actually somewhat liked the pre-workout. So again, not a bad pre-workout. Actually, the benefits outweighed the bad, in my opinion. The only bad things that I received from that pre-workout were just the jitters and the itchiness that I felt, and obviously the increased heart rate, which is normal. But most of the benefits came out of this product. So I definitely give it an 8 out of 10. This is a good product. Give this video a like. Stop what you're doing right now before you even click out of this video. Like the video. Subscribe. Share this with your friends. Definitely share this with your friends so that people can take a look at their products. Because it's really good products. So share this with your friends. It helps, you know, the algorithm thing with me especially. So take a look at what they got. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.